we are asked is the area of a rectangle triangle more than 25 so i can answer this in yes or no now let's see if one of the perpendicular sides is 6 let's say this side is 6 can i comment on what this side should be or no not at all or is there any guarantee that this side has to be some other value so i can make a right angle triangle with a side of 6 and 1 also and some whatever this comes out to this may not be an integer we are not bothered or I can make a right angle triangle with this as 6 and this as 100 also and some value we don't we really don't want to know so in this case if I say my area will be half of 6 into 1 which is 3 in this case my area will be half of 6 into 100 which is 300 your question is is it surely more than 25 can I say for sure or no so the first statement is not sufficient don't think if it is 6 then it has to be 6, 8, 10 that will be wrong logic with 6 you can make infinite triangles now let's see the second the largest side is 10 if I look at that bit if this value is 10 I am sure this has to be less than 10 and this has to be less than 10 now the triangle's nature cannot be infinite it cannot be totally elastic I can stretch it anyway now according to you when will this area be maximum we will learn this in the geometry part of it but this area is maximum when the sides are equal or unequal so this area is maximum when the sides are actually equal if you don't know this right now no problem at all if this value is x this value is x then only the area comes out maximum i can in fact make this triangle in two ways suppose this value is 10 and i can take this value as let's say 9.9 .9 some value some value whatever and 10 will it be a small area or large area if i take a triangle like very thin strip very very little area zero almost if i can take it the other way around also that okay this is 9.9 uh, .9 and this is 10 then also my area will be small so overall my area will be large only when it is equal if i use the Pythagoras theorem I can use x square plus x square is equal to 10 square all of us know this so x square is 50 x will be 5 root 2 root of 50 so this value comes out 5 root 2 this value also comes out 5 root 2 what will be the maximum area of this triangle let's see half of 5 root 2 into 5 root 2 if I cancel root 2 root 2 and 2 this area is maximum of 25 what is your question is it more than 25 i can say a confirm answer no and what should be my answer now because which statement gave me the answer fun did not give me the answer second gave me the answer so b is my answer finally now this question is a classic c trap problem tell me if you combine the two statements will they surely be enough or not enough but do I need to combine the two statements the point is if one side is 6 the other is 10 what would have been the third side 8 6 8 10 you find out the area half 6 into 8 is 24 you would have said no it is not more than 20 but I should not combine if any one statement alone can give me the answer so that would have been totally wrong as a step I should not combine at all unless each statement alone is not enough.